they have an ICU. Look at that. Look at that. There's their school over here. There's the park. Memorial Park. We are guys in Red Creek. Guys, there's a free library. There's a lot of beautiful homes too. Check out this mansion. This deserves an extra look. That's very pretty. There's a nice church over here. Located in Wayne County. The median home value here is $82,000. Median rent, sub, uh, $591. And about 60% of folks own their homes here. any reviews from folks who actually live here there are two reviews on niche.com the first one reads Red Creek is a small town there are a limited number of people so it's a very quiet location people who move here typically stay a great number of years due to the education that their children receive in a small community public school the houses within the community are typically affordable and well maintained. Many people do not worry about allowing their children to mingle uh, as well as hang out within the community due to the nature of the individuals that live here. I particularly enjoy the fact that my children have uh, made so many friends and built so many relationships with great people here. Okay. What's this? La Victoria Mini Market. Looks like a Mexican grocery store. Definitely not much going on here in Red Creek. New York a lot of old buildings
and a lot of empty storefronts. This is a mechanic shop over here. All right, let's head back. Let's get closer to the creek. Super windy today, but super warm. Wonderful day. Cool beans, cool beans. And we are on Water Street. What is that? Cornerstone Restaurant and Tavern across the street on Water Street and Main Street. And that's the scenic byway that runs parallel to Lake Ontario. There's a karate school over here in the center, in the center of the village. There is a karate school called Kokoshin Karate. I'm probably mispronouncing it. There's a bunch of trolls here. It's a fairly small, fairly small karate dojo. I'm just glad it's not an empty storefront like this place. Not sure what this used to be back in the day, but a lot of these mom and pop shops are drying out in these small towns across America. And a lot of it has to do with uh, the C word, the C word. Hopefully we can put it all behind us soon. Well, that, that was the walkthrough of Red Creek. Until next time, guys. The wind, guys. It's crazy. We're at a playground by the Gato School. Who needs a kite? You are the kite. hit by a tornado or something.